just shelters like the navigation center that I'm at right now, as well as the mission at, at Kern County, believe that you know donating clothes is incredibly important right now, especially this time of year when it's starting to get really cold. Because for some people, these donations are the only things that are keeping them warm. It can be really hard on the on the human body to uh, survive um, in that kind of environment. There are more than 800 homeless individuals in Kern County who are unsheltered. And with the coldest months just around the corner, those individuals may not be ready for that weather change. That's why multiple shelters are stepping up to help, including the M Street Navigation Center, which opened in May. They're hosting a warm for winter drive, asking for donations during the month of November to help the homeless. As we, you know, fairly new opening, we don't have like a whole lot to just go and say, hey, here you go. So we really need the public's assistance and, you know, coming out and supporting our individuals. Lori Huey with the Navigation Center says they're asking for jackets, blankets, hats and gloves, anything to keep people warm. You know, those are for us, right, that we don't need those kind of things. That's a very basic thing. But for those that don't have it and want to try to stay warm, that's uh, that's huge. Carlos Baldovinos from the Mission at Kern County tells 23 ABC that they're also accepting much needed clothing donations. You know, for us as an organization, we constantly invite if there's anybody around within our radius, we want to keep inviting people in, um, especially now you get into the colder weather. Our, our individuals are human. They, you know, fill all conditions of the weather, whether it's warm, cold. We want everybody to know if they can please whatever they have, you know, to give, to please just help. If you want to donate, then you can drop off supplies at the front of the Navigation Center. They do want to remind you that you do have to social distance and, of course, wear masks as well. There's going to be more information on our website, turner23.com. For now in Bakersfield, Bain Ferroni, 23ABC, connecting you.